What's going on guys? Today I'm going to show you how you can install a custom kernel on your Galaxy Nexus phone or any other Android phone at that matter. Um, today I'm going to be installing Franco's kernel just because it's a kernel that I really like to use <coughs> and I have no problems with it. Um, so the first thing you're going to want to do is download the kernel. This is going to be a .zip file. Do not unzip it. Do not extract it. Keep it as a .zip file and then you're going to put it on your phone just like any other song or any other file so once you put it on your phone you're just going to want to make sure it's on your phone why did I deny that um, but just go into your SD card with any file manager you can do this on your phone I'm just going to show you that I do have it uh, on my phone so right there Franco's kernel number 364 <clears throat> after that you're going to want to hold the power button and reboot into recovery. Now this only works if you have a custom ROM. Um, if you don't have a custom ROM, there's many other ways to getting into recovery. One is downloading ROM Manager from the uh, Google Play Store and you can boot right into recovery from that app. So just wait for this to reboot into recovery. Uh, it is a pretty easy process once it gets in. And right now I'm using Clockwork Mod Recovery uh, brightness is kind of up too high. <clears throat> but the first thing you're kind of going to want to do is wipe cache partition. Uh, I don't know if you know, don't know if you see that, but wipe cache partition right there and just click wipe cache. This isn't a necessary step, but it is something that I like to do. Uh, next, you can go into advanced and do the same thing for Delvic cache, wipe Delvic cache. Just click that and it will wipe. Now, like I said, you don't have to do that, but it is recommended. Um, after that, all you have to do is click Install Zip from SD Card, Choose Zip from SD Card. Um, if you're on a Galaxy Nexus without a um, micro SD card, you're just going to hit the little zero, um, and then find the folder which you have placed the uh, actual kernel in. Whoops, mine's in my download folder. Um, and then you'll see Franco kernel nightly just tap that and then click yes to install and Down here it'll say oh no, there's no escape now Blah blah blah. Are you did you freak out? Thanks for installing Franco's kernel um, Just kind of a little fun joke added on to that But once you see that whole message, you know you are done and you know you can hit reboot device now and this will start your phone back up and you are going to be with a custom ROM.